Are you ready for it on this section here? Many of you are going to get healed. You. You ready? Right here. Are you ready? Touch! Come right into the dance. I worship Christ. Don't, no one touch me, please. severe pain in her stomach and she doesn't know but she's got cancer and she's feeling tremendous heat on her I can almost feel like it can get her she's right down there somewhere right where that there, there's a woman there with something red on I see like a red top or something in that area there is that woman all of you lift your hands and pray out loud in the Holy Ghost she's right on the other side almost you can go there. Those that are feeling that heat on your body, those that are feeling that healing anointing, come out of your seat and, and, and just line up on this side here. Quickly, if the Lord is healing you or has healed you, check it out. That's the woman right there. Bring her up there. The Lord is, if the Lord is healing you, you come out of your seat and stand right here. Everyone lift your hands and pray out loud in the Holy Ghost. You had pain in your stomach, my dear. Can you help me? Huh? Yes. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke that. I rebuke it in the name of the Lord my God. Help her up that. One of you over there has had troubles with your digestive system. You had troubles with your digestion. And the Lord has healed you standing here just a little while ago. You felt something go right through you. Is that you? Come here. Touch. Don't go down, my dear. Don't go down. You stay right here. Touch. Come here.
from the top of her head to the soles of her feet flows the airline. Lord, I rebuke that problem in her body that she'll never ever suffer with it again. For the glory of Jesus in a wonderful name. Just lift your hands and pray out loud in the spirit. I saw something red on you, and there it is. I never had lived that. I never really um, accept that I have cancer. I always say, no, my God is real. And, you know, but I go and I did the surgery. I had radiation. I never had chemotherapy. What happened tonight? The pain gone. I feel it. I didn't do. I never had the pain as such, but you know, like when I would stretch and bend, I would get a kind of pain. Okay. Check it out. Check it out now. Right? Bring it back, guys. Bring it back. 
You are the God that heals. Are you a husband? Take the anointing, brother. Whoa. You are the Lord. Lord. A double dose, Lord. You need it. A double dose. You know, you will get, what caused the pain? I was in a gas explosion two and a half years ago and I had to jump out the window. I shattered the leg. You shattered which leg? This one? The right leg. Okay, pick it up now.
I love it. I just love it. You need to invite me to more of these meetings. Yeah, so black churches. Yeah. So black churches. Black churches. Of course, black churches. Hey, I'm half black. Yes, you are. See, I love the way they receive, you know? It's just so hungry for all its power, you know? Don't you love it? I, yeah, of course I love it. I love to see people being blessed like that. Now, now darling, it is whatever is gone. Huh? Oh, I feel such a mighty hand on here. Let me enjoy it. For you are holy. Come on, let's, let's lift your, your hands up. All honor and glory. In adoration we bow before your throne. Higher keep lead. Declare your majesty. The punk girl is all over that girl. She had an accident some years ago, Pastor. Well, her back. Well, she can go down now. Had some bulging discs. It was unable, unable to have been down. For oh, your own magnificent, you rule victorious. Your power is shown throughout the earth. You feel that marvelous and ornate like that? Yes. So what, what was wrong with you? I had four near fatal car accidents. So? Four near fatal car accidents in the same car. And it took a bulging, bulging disc in my back. And I have a slip disc. Can you check it out? Go ahead. Oh. I can bend. Let's go. <laughs> no pain. In adoration, we bow before your throne. Holy. You know the, all the old hymn? Holy, holy, holy Lord God of my little in the morning, my, my song. I, I, wanna, I want the, the, the organ that works. Come on. Let's all stand. Come on. Please. You know the old hit? For you are holy, 
Sing it again. All honor and glory. I want you all to lift your hands, pray this prayer the second. Out loud. me she's had circulation trouble so I called her over and she said she's had that uh, this leg this leg for two years two years and now this leg it's affected this side for the last year and the doctors don't know they don't know what it is can you tell me she's been losing feeling in those legs I'm here to tell you you're going to go back here And which flag that you are my lead, lift up your name, for you are holy. Touch, sing it again, all honor. Touch, glory. You guys need to be praying in the spirit. In adoration, but Josh, don't touch him. We bow before your throne. Just lift your hands, pray in the Holy Ghost. We exclaim that you are mighty. Lift up your name. Somebody right behind me, and I'm not ready to pray for you now, but you're in trouble with your skin. All honor and glory. Keep praying. Okay? The Lord has asked me to do something. I got to do it. I don't understand those things. I just obey. We declare your majesty. We proclaim that your name is exalted. For your reign magnificent, you rule. Victorious, your power. Is shown throughout the earth. Do you know I'm walking around you? Did you know that? You're feeling heat all around your body. Are you feeling it, lady? Yeah. I'm not done. Though. I'm going to do it one, one, one more time. Keep praying. The Lord just said, walk around the three times. I just obey. All honor and glory. Are you a husband? Come here, sir. So you feel that heat like a, like a circle? Just right there. You feel that heat like a circle on you? Can you describe it? Like a hurricane. Like a hurricane? I love it when they don't speak English today. Well, you feel tremendous heat all over your body. Well, your wife is healed completely. She'll never have to come with her. Let's give the Lord a big shout. Come on. Let's, let's help her up. Lift up your name. For you are holy. Hey guys, guys, you can't talk back here, okay? I'm sorry to tell you that, but it breaks the anointing. So, so if you want to talk, you can go back there. God's work is way more important than you guys chit-chatting back here. And the people said, Amen. You know, I mean, here we are, seeing God move upon people's lives, and somebody's chit-chatting back there. It's very disrespectful today, you know, and I just want to have it. Because people's lives are more important than that. And that's awesome. Think about the, the law, how long she suffered. And the people who are getting healed is precious. There's still healings happening everywhere here, so lift your hands, pray the Holy Ghost. Someone over here has had troubles with your chest. You have a lot of pain. 
chest pains. Hit you real hard. And you're right in this section here. Come here, darling, come here. But by the way, you can all sit down, you don't have to stand. You just stood by yourself. I didn't ask you to stand, but you stood and I'm glad. And how many people are in the overflow? Does anybody know how many are in there? Because there's healings happening over there. Huh? There's miracles happening. Everyone here for just a minute. And all of you, do you have one overflow or two overflows? One overflow. Pardon? This room and? They can see from the screen. Oh, they can see from the screen, okay. I want you in this uh, uh, auditorium and the people in the next overflow. Lift your hands, pray out loud in the spirit for just two minutes. Come on. Because the anointing for healing is also in the, in, the, in the other building. So I need someone maybe to help me or you people who are getting, who are there, who are getting healed. If the Lord is healing you in the other building, you need to come up and tell us what God did for you. So many of you felt and still feel tremendous heat on your body. You felt it earlier, very strong. And if the Lord is healed you, you, you can come and stand here. You may not make the platform, that's not the, that's not the, the point. You have to come and say, Lord, thank you. You know, even if you never make the platform. Just, but the very fact you stand there is affirming your healing in the, in, the, in, the, in the eyes of heaven. And the Lord sees you there and affirms it for you. Help her up to her. Come on, guys. Don't get too close to me. Is there something you can feel that's different? What is it? Huh? My legs. What about? I don't feel any pain. Keep praying. For, I told you I wanted to pray, but just another minute. Come on, please. Just one more minute. We declare your majesty. Okay. See, when you pray, the Lord talks to me. When you don't pray, I don't hear it. So you gotta pray just so I'm on hand. For you are magnificent, you victorious. Okay, the people hear me on Periscope are they able to hear it? Because I, I turned this on, so I guess they can hear me better. Okay, just let them make sure you tell me you sweet people watching. Okay. Jesus, wonderful Jesus. Bring perfect health to this couple. Perfect health. In the name of the Lord, my God. Just pray a little, just one more minute, please. What? <laughs> I said the Lord just showed me something about your heart. And he said he just had a heart attack. Two days ago is what your wife you, you said. When I looked at him, I just saw his heart. So the Lord is healing it. Right now. We have Jesus. Yeah. Touch! Oh. Touch oh. The Lord is healing the lady and the husband. Let's give the Lord a mighty hand of praise.
way down this land. He came here today completely healed. Oh. We. You know, I feel the anointing so strong here. So rise. What do you feel on me, brother? Still feel it, huh? Marvelous. Where are you from? I'm from Nigeria. The Holy Ghost is in this house. Lift your hands and say, Welcome, blessed Holy Spirit. You saw with the beard. Come here. Oh, the glory of your presence. Your temple. Can you pray to us another 30 seconds? It's interesting, you know, I just said I just saw his arm right here. And uh, so what, what did you tell me again? Every now and again, it just takes up and gets stiff and numb. Numb? It's a numb. Well, you know what causes it? I don't know. No, sir. Not after today. Yeah, but why, why would this, when they're in the... It's, it's just the Holy Ghost, Pastor. 
But when the spirit out of your belly shall flow, baby. that's it. Shouldn't that be? He said his stomach is on fire. 
right now. Can you hear the sound of heaven? <laughs> like the sound of many waters. What is he thinking? Oh, power. It's the sound of worship coming from the world. You know, we need this power. His name is the Holy Spirit. Oh, people, stand up and just love on Him. Come on. Stand up and love Him. You know who the Holy Ghost is? The third person of the Trinity. Who is He? He is Jesus without limitation. He's Jesus without limit. That's the Holy Spirit. He's, he, he's not a stranger to us. We know Him. He's the Spirit of the Lord. Thank you, Master. Lift your hands up, love you. What's happened to the living? She had RSD, whatever that is. She was <laughs> unable to do that. That's why she's doing it. She could not move her arms, her hand. She couldn't lift the Wait, wait, wait. Sir, come here a second. The Lord's going to use you in greater ways in the future than he did in the past. Thank you, Great anointing on you. Great anointing on you. People just lift your hands and receive from them. the Lord. We worship you, Jesus. Thank you for your lovely presence. Your reality is so precious in the service tonight. Oh, thanks for this blessed presence. What shall we do without you, Lord? Life means nothing without you. To whom shall we go? You have the words of life. O oh, blessed Son of the Highest. Wonderful Redeemer. Wonderful Savior. We love you. Mm. Good God. The only God. The only true God. Wonderful Jesus, the image of the invisible God, wonderful Jesus, we worship you, we worship you. Jesus, I love thee, I know thou art mine. For thee, everything, Lord, we give you everything, everything. My gracious Redeemer, my Savior, thou, if ever I love thee, my Jesus, 
is now fairest Lord Jesus just love him saints love it ruler of all nature oh thou of God and man the son thee will I cherish thee And crown. Hallelujah, what a Savior. Hallelujah, what a friend. Saving, helping, healing, loving will be with me to the end. Lift your hands and thank Him.
We declare your majesty. Come stand there, sir. We proclaim your name is exalted. You reign magnificent. Touch from the top of the table. You rule victorious. Your power. Don't touch me. Lift up your name. I'm waiting for you. Sing it again. Honor and glory. In adoration, we bow before you. Is the thing on now? Stretch your hands and pray for Andrew. You need to give him to the Lord now, okay? Give Andrew to the Lord. You need to take care of him. I stand, I stand. 
stand in awe of you. Wow. I stand, I stand in awe of you. Holy God, to you all praise is due. I stand in awe of you. You know why I sing like that? Because I get overwhelmed as the Lord is showing me things about these precious people. Because we're not worthy, you know, to receive our bell. You have tremendous stress. There was a lot of pain in your chest. How long have you had the pain in your chest? I've literally been feeling for the last couple of weeks. <laughs> I've been having these the last couple of weeks I've been having I just my weeks off and yeah but I see the pain on your chest yes Lord never again heave her now something coming up your leg. Just a second. In fact, you're already feeling it. You're right here. It's coming up your leg. You feel it? Like what? What that? Heat, but I can't stop shaking my legs. It's coming right up your legs. I feel your whole being. Get, get ready. That's it. That's what, what God is doing is arising, he's stirring the anointing that's already in you. And the Lord's gonna start using you. For your glory. You are beautiful beyond. It is under power. Now it's your turn. Majesty. That's literally don't touch this guy. I stand, I stand. You know. I'm going to start with something right on this way in a second. Lift your hands and pray. You need a little help. Some people just get a little help. That's all. Somebody just, some just takes a little help. To you, all praise. Oh, yeah. Here yeah, it is. You are beautiful beyond all description. You feel it now? What do you feel? I can't stand up. Huh? Like I can't stand up. <laughs> What's up, all God? Do wonderful for a comprehension. That's nothing I want to see. You, you got something wrong here? 
is it? I'm just hitting him in his leg right here. Now, because I, I, I see something wrong with your head, with your, with your ear. Yes, yes. You feel something when I'm hitting you? Yes. What do you feel? I feel depressed. Huh? I feel depressed. The what? I feel depressed. Oh, I'm here. Well, there's something I'm depressed. Present. We're going to start with something else. Yeah, yes. You feel that? Yes. The, the heat? Yes, the heat. Yeah. I just kicked him and he felt the heat. I didn't actually have him. I just kicked him. Are you feeling that? Yes, yes. Just move it. Just to see, okay? You are beautiful, Lord. Yeah. Okay, now, you decide you're going to declare it every day that Andrew is a man of God. Say it. Andrew is a man of God. Okay. It, it say it. I want you to say it seven times. And I want all of you, all of you, to stretch your hands and agree with that. Come on. Now, you already said it once, okay? You're going to say it six more times. And all of you are going to pray for her. Andrew is a man of God. 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 I stand, I stand. What is happening this guy? Can God pick him up? I don't know. You better get it up here. I want to see what's going on here. Holding on to you. Hey, guys, guys, guys. You know, I can't help it. When that only flows, it flows. You better get up and work. You too, Wesley. That's my son over here. That's Josh. I stand, I stand. Okay, pick him up, guys. He really cannot get up, this guy, but he's under heaven and all. Wait, wait, wait. Are you okay? Are you fine? Okay, thank God, I'm a little drunk. You better not drive a car tonight or they're gonna give me a ticket. Or worse than that. Okay, what happened to the people? So many of them, there's just such a long line there. Back pain, completely gone. Can we help them up, guys, gentlemen? I stand, I stand in all of you. You guys are doing good. Holy God to you. You can help him up. I stand in all of you. No, no, I'm done with her. Oh, oh, that's your husband. I forgot. Are you okay? Wait, what do you feel on here? Happiness is a sign of relief. Happiness what? Yeah, some kind of relief. Relief, relief. You, you want to get up or you want to just stay down there? Stay down there. I'm just staring at the light. Wait, you want to get up? He said like, just, just staring at the light. <laughs> he just enjoyed himself. Huh? Judge, can I ask God, please, David, his right to support? 
got to go before the judge for what? He was leaving a funeral and the guy banged on his, on his car and just let him have it. He beat him up. He beat him up. And now, now he won't favor with the judge. Like he beat the man up. Okay. I want you all to stand because I'm gonna come on stand up. Please stand up. I'm going to ask God to do something you don't deserve. And God's going to do it. Because you're His child. But I'm, I, I hear the Lord say to me, tell Him not to beat anyone after that. Like, don't do it again. Now here's what I'm, I'm, I'm going to pray. I'm going to pray that the judge, that, that God will touch his heart with such tenderness towards you that he's going to drop the case. You don't, you, you don't, you know, none of us deserve that. None of us. I mean, I've had troubles with legal things. You know, I've never beat anybody. Thank God. I felt like doing it, but I never did. But, you know, we all have uh, legal whatever. I've never been in trouble with the law. Thank God for that. But years and years ago, somebody sued me because they, they just wanted money. There was a, they, you know, they come after us preachers for all kinds of stupid things. And the judge was a lady who was quite nasty. She hated preachers. And I was in Jerusalem at the wedding hall. And I just prayed, I said, Lord, I said, you're God, not the lady. She, she's only a woman judge who doesn't like Christian preachers. And so I called my lawyer, he said, impossible, he said, this lady cannot, she hates televangelists. He said, you are in her eyes a preacher who's on TV and she, she sees you in a negative light. I said, listen here. I called his name, I said, I said, you go to the judge and let me do my business. Let me do what I what I know to do with God. Yes. Ten <laughs> minutes later, my my it was you know back a few years ago when we had those big big cell phones. Remember them? The big thing. It's a long time ago. Long time ago. <laughs> that thing rings. I'm in Jerusalem. I just said to the Lord, I said, Lord, do it because you love me. I said, touch the heart of this lady because she's only a lady judge. You're God. Ten minutes later, my, my phone rings. He said, I don't know what you did. He said, the woman just dropped the whole case. <laughs> and she dropped the whole case. Now, I can tell you, you know, thank God I've never had, you, you probably won't believe this, but it's, it's true. I have never even got, I have never even gotten a ticket by the police, like speeding ticket. Never once in all the years I've been driving have I even had a ticket. Because I'm a law-abiding citizen. I obey every little dot of it. Take your seats. But because I'm a preacher, there's people that hate preachers, who want to hurt us. And they claim all kinds of things that didn't happen, but they, they lie and they just want money. That's all they want. And that judge was really a very tough woman. And she dropped the case. In all the years I have ministered, the only time I ever get in trouble is when I fail the Lord. That's the time she just won't answer me. If I'm doing something that is displeasing to him. He just won't answer me. But lately I I woke up. You know, when the Lord, I almost died last year. I was in the hospital with a 
uh, can just avoid failure because I just didn't take care of myself. But I feel marvelous now. But anyways, I made a deal with God. I said, Lord, I'm going to serve you for the rest of my life. I'm going to walk with you. I'm going I'm to obey you and not disobey you. I just want one thing from you. Never ever cut me off. I said, you can punish me all you want. Just never leave me. Please yes. answer that prayer. Yes. So why don't you lift your hands and say, Father, Father punish, me all, all you want. punish me all you want. Never leave me. Never say it again, never leave me. Never you can chastise me. Yes. You can punish me. Yes. If I'm bad, you can punish me, Lord, but never, ever leave me. Amen. Well, when you love your children, you're going you're gonna to punish them for what they do wrong. Huh? He's our Heavenly Father. So, stretch your hands towards this paper. Now, Lord, I ask you to do this because you love us and because your word says you answer prayer. Now, Lord, I'm bringing this before you from this judge who wants to punish this man for beating this guy. Master, cancel it. Yes, Lord. For your sake. Not for your sake, sir. For your sake, Jesus. Now you lift your hands and promise God you won't do it again. Both hands. He's the, he is the judge. He's the great judge. And not that lady or that fellow. You, you promise? Okay. I'm going to give you, uh, I need to know what happens, but I can tell you I know already what's going to happen. He's going to dismiss it, okay? You just be, you just be nice to him. <laughs> the Lord just told me to tell him that. Okay, be nice. And when you're nice and kind and so, you watch what I told you is going to happen. So you take that. That's all. But I, but... Dear Marie, you can give him somebody's number who can call call us so we can rejoice with you. Goodbye. Let's give the Lord a mic. Come on. He's able. Yeah, now pick up that guy. He's able. He's able. I know he's able. You, you guys need to teach you the old songs. I know my Lord is able to carry me through. What happened, John? Back pain. Completely healed. Wow. Huh? You know the song? Yeah. Oh. Now, listen, I want you all to stay, please. Everyone. I, I, I want to... It's 11 o'clock, so I don't want to keep going. But isn't the Lord good? Can we give the Lord a mighty hand of praise? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. First of all, let's just lift our hands and thank you. Thank you, Lord, for what you've done tonight. A million thanks for all your goodness to us. You know that old song, you deserve the glory and the honor. Can we just tell him that wonderful Lord we serve? Precious Jesus, we love you. You deserve the glory and the honor. Lord, we lift our hands in worship as we bless your holy name. You deserve the glory and the honor. Lord, we lift our hands in worship as we bless your holy name. For you are great, you to be, you are 